I've got a little coconut diddly D. There they are standing in a row. Boom, boom, boom. Big one, small one, some as big as my head. That's all I know. I got that from Lion King. <laughs> okay, so I am making this video because I am discovering something for the first time, which now that I'm discovering, it's kind of funny that it didn't happen until now, but it didn't. All in perfect timing, I guess. A coconut. Fresh coconut. My friend Scott um, brought home a coconut and he drilled into it and poured out the milk and cracked it open and I've just been having fun like chewing on it and eating it and finding things out. So now I'm playing with some flavors. I'm at my friend T's house babysitting her little kitty and she's got some rosemary in the garden. So I've been playing with rosemary. I had it on pears earlier. That was awesome. I have some strawberries here that were about to go bad in the fridge. So I took those out. I was eating them. And then I fried some of those with rosemary. Mm, my gosh, it just smells so good. So, taking my rosemary, taking the little buds off, and I am mincing it into teeny tiny pieces. And I realize you can't see it, but whatever. Okay. Teeny little tiny minced rosemary. And then I've got my coconut broken out of the shell. And I'm cutting like, I'm taking chunks of it. So... I've got this big old piece here, and then I take um, like a chunk of it into that size, and then I cut it kind of down a little bit, and then I cut it in half too and make it like a thinner piece of coconut. Then I use salt on it. Kind of bring out some of that yummy flavor. So here's what I'm thinking. Get some coconut bits laid out here, and I'm gonna pour some salt. I've got this heavy coarse salt, and I'm gonna just gonna go to town on it. Oh wait, you know, cause it's kind of big. Maybe I should put this in a bowl and like mix it all up. Yeah, bowl, bowl. Okay, gonna dice up my coconuts. A little bit smaller so they're like bite size ish pieces okay bite size coconut I'll take all these coconut bits little squares little maybe half inch to a quarter inch coconut squares mm -hmm. and then now I'm ready to salt them. I put them in the bowl. Oh yeah, and you know what? I might as well just put the rosemary that I minced up in there too. Okay, minced rosemary, delicious. Right on top of the coconut. And salt. I'm gonna go a little bit heavy because this is like coarse salt, it's kind of thick and big and I want it to break down and get into the coconut so this is going to probably need a little bit of time to marinate. Now I'm going to use strawberries. So I cut these strawberries up into like quarters but I think I want them to match the size of my coconut so I'm going to go ahead and cut each of these quarters into half which means like little strawberry eighths little cubes of strawberry. So the strawberry is pretty liquidy and I think what's gonna happen, my guess, because salt does the thing where it expresses water out of things, it should express the water out of the strawberry which will help dissolve the salt more and help all of these flavors marinate together. Okay? Okay. So I have no idea if this is gonna be good together. I don't know. 
I mean, I'm barely discovering what coconut is like for real, real coconut. Totally different than that flaky stuff that they put on cake. Ugh, I never liked that stuff. It was so gross. I mean, some people loved it. My mom loved it. Blech. So we got some bits. We got some really good bits. Who, I just don't know why I never thought of herbs on fruit. Herbs and fruit, people. With everything. Fruit with everything. Okay. So, obviously it hasn't been very long. The flavors aren't mixed up super well, but I can already smell it. I can smell the rosemary mixed with the strawberry. Wow, I mean that alone is amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna try a bite of this here. You get a strawberry and a coconut, and I can see that there's rosemary bits, and hopefully there's some salt in here. The texture is weird. Oh, the flavor is good. Oh man, mm, the flavor is so good. Okay, maybe this little mixture bit isn't the way to go, but I got an idea. We'll stack it. Oh, wow. doing this again. Mm. Okay. Let's take a, oh man, I already cut the strawberries all the wrong way for a stack. Oh wait, no, I can like mince it into a tiny little strawberry bits and use the coconut as like a cracker bottom. Yeah, and then, okay, so I'm gonna, Take some salt and so, and then like put it on top of the coconut. Big old crunches of salt. Yeah, yeah. Then I'm gonna put the strawberries, pile it on. Pile, just, I'm gonna go over the top here. And put these little strawberry bits on here. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, my mouth is watering just watching myself here. This is great. Um, how do I want to do the rosemary? I could do like a little fancy, we could be the fancy chef here and we could stick the rosemary where to go. Right in there, that's not working for me. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, like that. Little stack. But I don't know if it'll like eat very well with that rosemary, so I'm actually gonna um, mince it up. But it was cute, huh? It was really cute. Yeah, I think it's cute. Especially like red and green. Red and green, opposite colors. On white, I mean like, geez, it's like Christmas. Christmas here in flavors of real food. Okay, okay, here's here's my snack. I'm gonna make a whole plate of these. You should come over for dinner sometime. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. yeah. Maybe a little bit too much salt. Whatever, it's my first day. Can't get it right on your first day all the time. Mmm. Yes. Yes. Coconut cracker bits. Buy a coconut, try it out. Eat it. Or do whatever you want. Okay. Well, thanks for playing with me. Bye.